Hey, what's up? This is Scott with the Level Up Tuts, and today I'm going to be talking about Sublime SFTP. So you need to get Sublime SFTP if you want to be using FTP directly in Sublime text. It's really cool, it's nice and easy, and there's a really awesome sync folder function that if you're managing files on your server and editing them, then this is going to be the way to do it. In fact, it's, it's part of my workflow when I'm editing uh, files on the server itself. What you need to do is Command Shift P on a Mac and go to Package Control, Install Packages, and search for Sublime SFTB. And I actually have it already installed. In fact, if we go to my Package Manager and List Packages, we'll see SFTP right here. So you can see that's its name, um, and the you know it's from wbond.net slash Sublime Packages slash SFTP. So that's the one. And after you have that installed. Uh, keep in mind that this is actually a paid plugin, and you can use it just like Sublime without paying, but they're going to bug you with messages saying to pay. I've gone ahead and purchased it because I use it every day. Um, in fact, if it comes up with a message saying I haven't, then that's probably because I haven't put the license in this particular computer yet. But if you do Command-Shift-P and you bring up your menu here, and we start to type SFTP, you'll see that there's some commands here. We can do all sorts of stuff. So we're going to actually just set up a server. So let's browse to a server first, and it's going to ask to uh, add a new server. If you've already added servers, they'll appear here. You can click on them, and you'll just log in just like that. But if we need to add one, let's click Add a New Server. And you'll notice it's coming up with this, this document here. And I'm going to go ahead and put in my server information. and. Uh, I'm going to leave it as SFTP, sync down on open, true, and there's not anything else I'm going to do with this. However, I'm going to add, uh, uncomment this line right here that says password, and put in my username, put in my password, and put in my host, and then I'm going to go ahead and save this. So I'm going to do that, but um, because I don't want you having my SFTP password, I'm going to go ahead and do that off screen. And I don't have a path to go to, so I'm just going to leave that like that. And I'm going to save this as um, Scott. And this is just my site. It saves in your SFTP servers folder. And I'm going to go ahead and add this password. Okay, and one more thing. I actually had to have the FTP settings to FTP, not SFTP, uh, for this particular login. But that's just for this login. So if you're getting a message saying it's not working, try FTP, try SFTP. I mean, it should work the same as your normal FTP client. So I have my server in here now. Now I can type in SFTP browse server. And now I can click Scott. And it might come up with a little message down here. It might immediately just log you in. And here's a list of all the folders in the server path that I'm on. So here's all the whole bunch of stuff I got. And um, if I just go into HTTP docs, and let's go to, this is a Drupal site, by the way, sites all themes. And I'm going to find a particular file I want to edit. This is maybe just a CSS folder. Um, and it's going to ask me what I want to do. I want to edit it. Here it opens it up directly here. And now notice when I save it, there's a message that comes up down here saying it's uploading this file back to my server. So anytime I have a file, I pull down, um, we'd say SFTP, browse server. And I can it's, notice how it leaves me off in the place I was just at. Um, I can open any of these files, edit them, throw them right back up when I click save. So that's cool. That's Sublime SFTP. In the next video, I'm going to show you how to set up a sync folder and the wonders of that. So as always, if you have any questions, leave a comment in the video or hit us up at Twitter, Level Up Tuts. We're on Facebook. We're all over the place. So as always, this is Scott, and thanks for watching. Bye.